today's dynamic network environments, lab managers must allocate hundreds, if not thousands of devices, which present a whole new set of problems. In the next few moments, I will go over these problems and how they can be solved with MRV's Media Cross Connect. Some of the typical problems are the following. Cable reconfiguration. Cable mistakes happen on a daily basis, which costs time and money. Cables and plugs tend to wear out and eventually break. Reconfiguration can take up to a few hours. Human capital. Users need to be close to the equipment, which makes remote testing practically impossible. This also makes 24-7 testing hard to accomplish. Capital expenditures. In today's economic climate, it is impossible for everyone to have the equipment they need. Resources are limited and must be shared efficiently. The solution to all these problems is MRB's Media Cross Connect, which is a digital patch panel that comes in a variety of chassis and blades to match your application. Here's how it works. Find devices which require many cable reconfigurations in your lab. Connect these devices to your MCC. Using any of our interfaces, simply map the ports. Traffic will now flow non-intrusively and at wire speed. And this all happens at the physical layer. Once you have bought an MCC, here are some of the key benefits. Cable reconfiguration. All configuration changes are done via simple software commands. Cable management becomes a breeze since all device connections can be quickly found in the MCC. Minimize the need to troubleshoot cable loop problems, which all reduces the test setup time from hours to just a few minutes. Operational expenditures. Reduce the need to have people on site managing connections, essentially leading to the lights out lab. Remote and 24-7 use of the lab cuts down on the need for replicated environments. Automation. Test repeatability improves regression testing, and test accuracy saves time and money. Capital expenditures. Equipment can be shared efficiently, remotely, and on a 24-hour basis. Applications. The traditional application is equipment sharing. What is accomplished is the end-to-end -end connection between two devices. For example, you may have two West Korea groups, one in the US and one in India, and they have to share one set of test equipment. When the US group comes in the office, they can use all the equipment since the group in India doesn't need the equipment, and vice versa. This repeats itself, which leads to the benefits of remote access and equipment being more fully utilized. Protocols. A wide variety of protocols are supported. For example, Ethernet from 10 megabit up to 10 gigabit per second, Sonic from OC3 up to OC192, and Fiber Channel from 1 gigabit all the way up to 8 gigabit per second. The Media Cross Connect comes with four different types of interfaces. The first, a command line interface, is the industry leader. It is user friendly and is commonly known as a Cisco like interface. It comes in three different types of flavors console, SSH, and Telnet. Our second interface, our GUI, Pathfinder, is a simple, intuitive application. It focuses on mapping, which reduces the learning curve. It is also embedded and secure, which requires no installation on the local machine. Our third interface, our API, is based on Tickle, which is the industry standard for test equipment. It is simple with a low learning curve, so there is no need to learn expect. It is meant for automation of the MCC. Our fourth interface is SNMP. We offer full SNMP, GET, SET, and TRAP support. All MCC functions are available in our MIP file. The Media Cross Connect was designed with modularity in mind. Most of the components are hot swappable, for example, our blades. This is our SFP based blade, which supports the Ethernet, Fiber Channel, and Sonic protocols. This is our RJ45 base blade, which supports 10, 100, 1000 megabit per second copper ethernet. This is our XFP base blade, which can support 10 gigabit ethernet. And this is our RJ48 blade, which supports the T1 protocol.